The group Verity Now, the only one calling for change. Uh, the use of crash test dummies that simulate uh, men, women, and children. The University of Virginia study, which found that a seatbelt wearing woman is 73% more likely to be seriously injured in a frontal car crash than a man. We are talking about thousands of love lives and serious injuries that can be saved if we employ female crash test dummies in our rating systems with regard to crash test worthiness for cars. NHTSA needs to require that female crash test dummies be used in the driver's seat for all tests in the NCAP five-star safety rating program. They don't even attempt to test car safety on the female body. This is part of why crashes injure and kill women at higher rates than men. This is an area I've, I've written to you about of the use of female uh, dummies in crash testing. It's yet another example of a gender bias with very real physical consequences. Except, this is one your mom didn't even know to warn you about. Hi, I'm Susan Molinari, and I'm co-chair of an organization called Verity Now. I was really disturbed when I found out that women are 73% more likely to suffer severe injuries in a car crash and are more likely to die in a car crash than their male counterparts. Then I was really angry when I found out that it's because regulators are not mandating that car manufacturers use female dummies in their crash tests. So we at Verity now decided it was no, that time was up, that we could no longer put women's lives in danger. So we spent the last two years trying to make our voices heard and make more people aware of this issue. We're doing it because we want to save women's lives and stop the bias. Now, over these last two years, we've had some great success from taking this from an issue no one ever heard of to one that people throughout the country really care about. Importantly, we have legislators in the Capitol on both sides of the aisle, in the House and the Senate, who have taken up and championed our cause. You know, we are so grateful to all our supporters who have helped us get this far, but clearly there's still some more work to be done. We need to lower those numbers and we need to make women as safe behind the wheel as men are these days. So if you would like to join the fight, please go and look up www.veritynow.org, V-E-R-I-T-Y-N-O-W.org. Please help us make a difference in women's lives.